A new breathtaking photograph reveals that the asteroid Dimorphos generated a bright debris tail reaching hundreds of miles. Two days after the NASA Double Asteroid Redirection Test, or DART probe, collided with the space rock. DART is the first mission meant to investigate whether such a collision might redirect a hypothetical asteroid threatening to reach Earth, and its impact with the double asteroid Dimorphos blasted to dust and debris from the surface, creating a comet-like tail. Using the 4.1-meter Southern Astrophysical Research, or SOAR, telescope at the National Science Foundation-funded Noir Lab Cerro Tololo Inter-American Observatory in Chile, astronomers Teddy Coretta from the Lowell Observatory and Matthew Knight from the U.S. Naval Academy captured images of Dimorphos' new tail. After the hit, Coretta remarked in a statement, It is amazing how clearly we were able to capture the structure and extent of the aftermath in the days following the impact. The amount of material ejected, the speed at which it was launched, and the size of the ejected particles may all be inferred from observations of the ejected material, which might help scientists establish the nature of Dimorphos' surface. Space organizations like NASA might use this information to better estimate how to deflect potentially dangerous asteroids. On September 26th, when DART collided with Dimorphos, a cloud of material was expelled, later to become the dust trail. Radiation pressure from the sun pushed the debris out from the body of the asteroid, resulting in a tail-like shape, similar to what happens to comets as they travel through the solar system and eventually make a close pass by the sun. The new feature of Dimorphos is visible in the sore picture, stretching from the image's center to its right side. The researchers calculated the length of the tail based on its distance between Earth and Dimorphos at the time the photograph was taken, around 2,600 miles, or around 10,000 kilometers. Scientists believe Dimorphos was around 525 feet, or 160 meters broad, before the collision. SOAR will keep an eye on the impact site after DART detonates its payload, gathering data that will be used to determine how effective the mission was in changing the asteroid's orbit. SOAR plays a pivotal role in the network of telescopes known as the Celestial Event Observatory Network, or EON, whose only purpose is to swiftly investigate reports of new astronomical occurrences. Let us know what you think in the comments section below. And as always, don't forget to like, subscribe, check out our previous videos, and visit our website if you love reading at www.nasaspacenews.com. Thanks for watching.